That was relevant to what we're talking about. voice actors. Okay, well, I do have quite a few favorite voice actors, um, but let's let's try and keep this as short as possible. My two absolute favorite voice actors have been my the same favorite voice actors practically my entire life, uh, and this goes not just for anime, but this goes for cartoons from when I was a kid as well, and that would be Scott McNeil and Brian Drummond. Uh, I actually had the honor of meeting Scott McNeil back in 2007, and that was probably one of the greatest honors of my entire life. Meeting Scott McNeil was absolutely amazing. I love Scott, um, and he's he's been a part of my life since practically diapers. He's been doing voiceover since the 80s, and uh, I watched pretty much everything he's ever done. Looking back, most cartoons that I watched turned out to be cartoons that were done up in Vancouver, minus the Nicktoons. Nicktoons were always done in LA, but pretty much anything beyond Nicktoons was done up in Vancouver. And I liked so many things from up there, and Scott McNeil tended to be in all of them, as did Brian Drummond. The other kind of interesting thing about Scott McNeil and Brian Drummond was that uh, with a few exceptions, uh, like Gundam 00 and Inuyasha, their characters tend to be my favorite characters. Um, Death Note, Ryuk is my favorite character. Gundam Wing Duo is my favorite character. Um, Monster Rancher, Tiger is my favorite character. Uh, Dragon Ball Z, Vancouver dub, both of their characters are my favorite characters. Piccolo, who was played by Scott McNeil in the Vancouver dub, and Vegeta, who was played by Brian Drummond in the Vancouver dub. However, I do like Vegeta more than Piccolo. So if I had to pick between the two, I would pick Vegeta over Piccolo. Which is what makes this relevant. It's over 9, because that's Brian Drummond. Other than that, I really like uh, Brad Swale, Kirby Morrow, uh, pretty much anybody up in Vancouver. Kelly Sheridan um, are some of my favorites. Outside of Vancouver, Dan Green, uh, Mike St. Nicholas, who both do New York stuff, so for kids dubs, as well as NYAV Post dubs, um, things like that. Kyle, uh, Greg, has always been one of my favorites. One of the very few, I'll be honest, one of the very few voice actors that I actually like from Texas. Um, I'm not a big Texas person. I don't like uh, ADV, even though ADV no longer exists. I don't like ADV very much. I don't like Funimation very much. I despise Funimation when it comes to the dub of Dragon Ball Z, and it sucks that Vancouver doesn't get to do Kai, because I really want them to, but they don't get to, so fail. But yeah, I mean, those are some of my favorites. Uh, those would probably be my top. As far as Japanese voice actors are concerned, uh, you know, most people would say, like, Kape Yamaguchi, who did characters like Inuyasha, um, L in the Japanese version of Death Note, but I can't stand him, and I don't know why. Maybe it's just because of the way he plays Inuyasha that sticks in my head. I cannot stand him in Inuyasha, I just can't. I love the Japanese cast of Inuyasha. Inuyasha is probably the only Vancouver dub that I can sit down and comfortably watch the subtitled version without totally missing my favorite Vancouver voice actors. I love the cast of Inuyasha. Anybody who's in the Inuyasha cast, other than Kape Yamaguchi, I love them. The guy who plays Naraku, the guy who plays Sashomaru, the guy who plays Moroku is fantastic. I love him. Um, I love the girl who plays Kagome. Uh, she also does Mion and Shion in no, uh, Higurashi no Naku Koroni slash Kai slash Rei, uh, which is When They Cry. Um, I've watched that subtitled, and that is fantastic. She's an amazing actress, um, lots of great things, but I, those would have to be my favorite, basically Vancouver and then anybody in the Japanese version of Inuyasha, because they are all just incredibly talented, except for Kepe Yamaguchi, and I'm sorry to those of you who absolutely love him, because apparently he is like the Scott McNeil of Japan, 
but I, I just, for some reason, I just don't like him. So those would be my favorite voice actors, and just because I can. So AJ, tell me, how many people actually will die? It's over 9,000! Sarah, I'll see you tomorrow.